Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be making a few Halloween Dollar Tree DIYs. A few Dollar Tree Halloween DIYs are quick and easy and um, be quick to make. That is also from Dollar Tree and the strobe light too. I saw people make like the cauldrons with the strobe light inside um, so you can make anything with the strobe light um, let's just get to the crafts thanks for joining me <coughs> alright again like I said thank you for joining me um, I'm gonna make a few quick DIYs and we'll just get started three DIYs so we'll just get to it so the first DIY quick and easy it's not Halloween maybe, but it's fall um, and I found this um, maple leaf boutique beautiful crystal or fake crystal the Dollar Tree Tea lights there. These are the Lumescence Pumpkin Spice Scented Tea Candles, eight piece. And I have one already in here burning. As you can see, um, I got both of those of the candles and this also this other tea light holder at the Dollar Tree. Just light that up for you so you can see how it looks. that you just saw hanging I cut off a piece of his um, the fabric that he has on him and it's meant to fit around this bottle alright at the Dollar Tree they have this BU 3D fabric paint and white shiny so with this, I'm going to write on here um, like potions, making it into a potion bottle for me. So, I'm just give me one second here. So I just measured it out and I will start writing on here. So bear with me while I write on here. Hmm. 
Here we got a. Uh, it has start here on the nozzle. So this is supposed to be like a fabric, 3D fabric paint, and it actually is meant to dry in about four hours. You can use it on fabric, and uh, after four hours, you have to wait 72 hours before you can wash the fabric. So the fact this is imperfect, but it adds another touch to it. So bear with me. Making The word potions. a lot of crafts to do not for Halloween but for the holidays so I can't wait to do that so potion bottle um let's see I don't want to do anything else on there if you mess up but I don't really want to mess up so okay there we go not the word potion so start letting it dry it's meant to go around the bottle and originally it's going to paint the black and work on that and just leave it like that but I thought hey I can make use of the bottle I can put things into the bottle and I can change the name or sign on it each season so like now I can say potions and then for Christmas time I can say something else and I just can keep changing what I put in there make it useful. So I was thinking what can I use this bottle for? I wanted it for the kitchen area so I thought okay I have this half bottle of vanilla extract. Um, it's imitation. <laughs> but it's very useful when it comes to baking. Um, so I'm going to change bottles, put it in here because I'm almost running out. And anyway, once it's out, I have to buy a new bottle, so 
this one. Other bottles, not really useful so much. Mm, maybe. Maybe I can use it for. I could probably use this for. I have this oil I use for um, my plants, the neem oil. So maybe I can transfer it here because the other bottle I have is broken. And as you know, that smells. So I haven't zip locks for now, but maybe I can just see, transfer the neem oil into this bottle. I don't know. We will see. I'm not sure if I'm doing that or not. Alright, so. Alright, now I've transferred over the vanilla extract. Now yeah, this bottle is getting a little crusty. Um, I'm glad I had this idea. And it still has the styrofoam, so you can still have the same air blocking as this one. So we can go ahead and close that up. Um, I washed the bottle beforehand. Soap and water. Let it dry. Make sure it was um, it was in good condition. Alright, so we have that. There's a hydrocarbonic camera angle. Because it's talking and it wasn't painted. Alright, so next we can put on the ocean sign um, onto the bottle. something else. I'm using Mod Odd. I used to find this at the Dollar Tree, but now I don't. I love Mod Podge. You can do everything with it. Seal your... and make brushing on your paintings, or if you do that craft where you collage, Mod Podge is good for that. So, let me just find something to put the mud patch on. So I'm sure I have a brush somewhere, but, but I'm not looking for it. Right. I'm just kidding. A stirring stick and putting using it to put the mod pods on. Let me just go ahead and put this on. Just measuring. So I think I want it about here. So I'm just putting on this mod pod. So you want to don't use brush. If you ever used my brush on brush before, it makes the brush so hard. So that's not an option. Why don't you use glue? I have adhesive on it, but I can't find it for the life of me. So sorry. And why don't I use something else? Because I don't have it, so make sure you tighten this around the bottom. 
Alright, I'm looking for someone. And I'm gonna go and start this. Um, I need to see what the last bit. Put it. Maybe I need to put a little bit more to finish the light. Yes. Alright. Just hold it down because it's acting funny sometimes. So. Now you officially have your potion bottle. I'm going to bring it in which, uh, with me if I can do. Maybe if you have something like a ghost, where you can make a ghost and just put it on top. It's cute. And we'll go on to the next card. Let's go to the next card. It's a dry. Um, next craft. Last but not least, I think I have one more craft to go. Um, so I saw like something similar to this over on youtube and i thought i'd try it so basically what they did is got a jack lantern uh halloween bucket and they put like a candle inside like a fake candle not a real candle um and the light of it or like can be a tea light too if you want a fake one um the light of it um has to be strong enough to light up the whole bucket so i thought that idea was nice i didn't find any pumpkin and jack lantern looking uh buckets when i went to the dollar tree so what i did find was this container Container, which is like back up the camera. Um, it's like a plastic bucket. I don't know if you see it. Yeah, it's just a plastic bucket. And it comes with a lid. See that? Yeah. So, have that, and nextly, I have um, on the dollar tree these LED tea light candles. LED tea light candles, and. So all I'm going to do is get the bucket. And I will get the tea light and turn it on. Turn on the tea light. And you can put it inside and close the lid. And it makes the same effect. I thought 
thought that was pretty cool. Let me put it to the side. Now you can see more the light. So yeah, you can see more the light. Um, basically, it will always make the same effect. I mean, um, with the jack lantern bucket, you can leave. The, you know, it doesn't have a lid, so obviously it will be open. Um, so then you can see more of the light. Um, this one I think makes more effect if I close it.